Hi, I didn't see you there. I was too busy studying the wonderful world of marketing and figuring out how we could apply to it to small businesses. HR Macy provides masonry services to residential and commercial clients in the East and New England area. A service is a kind of uh, product, a good service or a dare consisting of tangible or intangible attributes that satisfy customer needs and receives in exchange for money or something else of value. Specifically, it is a specialty product. Uh, product customers make a special effort to search for and buy. Services are intangible activities or benefits. Because they provide a service, they must show the benefits of using the service in a concrete, presentable manner. H&R Masonry does so through providing a portfolio of pictures regarding their work, customers' positive testimonies for their projects, and a list of certifications demonstrating their qualifications. Services differ from products in inconsistency, delivery of service can differ each time, and in inseparability. Delivery of the service is inseparable from the quality of the service itself. Having workers be on their best behavior and the work done timely and efficiently is important for quality service. The landscaping industry seems to be a pure competition because there are hundreds of local small firms competing for jobs. Because of this, the first improvement I would suggest would be improving the company brand, which is the name, phrase, design, and symbols used to identify its products and differentiate it from those of competitors. There's other H&R masonry landscaping services that appear when searched online, and even I got confused when I first began this project. H&R Masonry targets customers with enough money to afford improvements to their homes or businesses. This means the age range is a few bit older since you need a decent amount of disposable income to purchase landscaping projects. As the younger, more social media savvy people, a large amount of which are online consumers, get older and have the money to afford improvements, H&R Masonry should make sure to market towards them as well. They should join social media and increase their online presence, as well as to demonstrating how their services are environmentally friendly and promote sustainability. For advertising, they should utilize a flighting schedule, alternating between normal running of advertisements and a cessation of advertisements to reflect seasonal demand, since they do not offer the majority of their services during the winter. I think they also have the opportunity to use publicity tools, which are methods of obtaining non personal presentation of an organization, product, or service without direct cost. Perhaps they could also use celebrity endorsements as publicity tools should they ever work at the home or business of a famous person, whether that may be nationwide or famous in the New England area. For example, an endorsement for a Patriots player would be good publicity. I believe HR Masonry can also expand to target market to local universities. New England is home to dozens of colleges and universities, many of which are expanding their facilities to attract new students. There are lots of opportunities for landscaping jobs, and association with universities would also be a good publicity tool. Similarly, they could also seek to work with state and local governments, many of which need their infrastructure and public works revamped, such as the recently derailed Red Line. Historic preservation might be a way to appeal to both governments and a public that is increasingly concerned with conserving important monuments from the past. There has also been a proliferation of do-it-yourself projects, tutorials, and videos easily accessible on social media. After strengthening the brand, perhaps H&R Mark Masonry can utilize brand extension, putting an established brand name on a new product in a new market, and enter the do-it-yourself market by selling home project tools such as trials and shovels. Thank you for watching this video. I understand this is a new light now, thanks to this marketing course. I really hope you enjoyed it.